Yeah. It's adventure time. Come on, grab your friends. Find your very distant lands. Check the dog and feed the human. Never ends adventure time. Got that blood sword is kind of big, huh? All right, blood, blood sword, blood sword, blood sword. There's one thing I like it's blood sword, blood sword. Blood sword, Finn and Jake. I, I, I don't know how, how easily you're gonna be able to beat this guy. He's kind of crazy, he's not very. I told them. I told them they weren't gonna be able to beat him. <laughs> Look, they got their little golden sword. This is like the first one they ever used, huh? I really like this one. Now we have two. How about another? And another. You can't fool me. I know you're still alive, then. Alright, you might not be alive anymore. That's okay, though. That's okay. Because I can always spawn another fin. Tree sword! A big ol' sledgehammer. Jake's pretty resilient. Alright. Come here, Jake. You think you're resilient, huh? Come on. Come on. I know he's not enough for this. Alright, you guys know that scene where Jake farts and... He says, I thought I thought it would be funny. This is that scene if instead of an avalanche or like a little earthquake thing happening, a new a lot of nuclear bombs went off. <laughs> it fin sword. Didn't take that one as well. And yeah, or that one. Or the subsequential hits with the fin sword. Fin? I would not. I would not touch that sword. I'll let you... He wants to touch it. I know he does. So I'm just gonna get it over with because I know, I know you're gonna want to touch it. I should say... This sword is not... A very nice sword. I guess think Finn would handle a shotgun to the kneecap. Took a foot off. Let's go one more time. That's not what I meant to do. Let's see how Finn the Human takes a AH-64 Apache Hydra 70mm missile airstrike. I don't think he's here anymore. Alright, Finn and Jake. Now we're in a tiny room, but we're gonna see how they deal with a lot of bombs. Alright. I'm afraid to unpause time, but we gotta...
Not... Not a win for these two, I'll be honest. Alright, so we've got a... A tunnel of crucible blades here. We're gonna take spin. We're gonna put them in there, alright? So you just go in. Just come on, come on, get in there. Come on, Jake. You have the same fate. Okay. Doesn't look like they did great. Let's try this out on them. And uh, swing! And uh, swing! And swing! 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 Oh, look at Finn trying to protect Jake. You can't do that! Swing! It's necessary to figure out their strengths and their weaknesses. Like, what if Finn gets shot at by a 50 caliber a thousand times, all at once? We gotta see if he can survive that or not. Alright, let's see. Let's see. Now we know. Now we know. Alright, let's just say Finn, this little guy, he is going to go into this corner in one immediate swoop with the power of probably a lot of jets, basically. He didn't blow up that time. Yeah. 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 Alright, in this universe we're going to assume that there are multiple Jakes and Finns, and there is a lot of tons falling on top of them at one time. Nice. Let's basically turn this into a smoothie. We don't want all this in here. We've got the banana gun. Don't underestimate the banana gun. Right, it can deal some serious damage. It's about the same premise as uh, earlier, except it's a grenade launcher, and we're gonna we're gonna be shooting a lot of these at them. But I think they'll be fine. I mean, I don't, it's just a grenade launcher. What could a grenade launcher do to somebody? Maybe, maybe re, rewrite down in my notes, the grenade launchers do, ha they, they do have effectiveness on people. 